outside. Weather outside looking good for Friday night plans. We've got a lot of playoff football action tonight. We're going to be in great shape for that. And it's looking good as we head into your Saturday as well. Temperatures will start out a little cool tomorrow morning, but I've already got us up to 57 by 10 o'clock. Highs tomorrow afternoon back up into the upper 60s to near 70, and then we'll cool it back down into the 50s again for any evening plans that you have. And clouds probably on the increase once we get to late afternoon and into the evening hours as a storm system that will bring our rain chances up late Sunday into Monday gets a little bit closer. Again, t temperatures tomorrow morning, they will be down into the 40s. There might be a spot or two in some of those favored low spots here. Eastern Oklahoma that could even drop into the upper 30s tomorrow morning, but not quite as cold as some of the numbers that we had out there uh, this morning. And then we'll work our way up into the 60s again tomorrow afternoon. Mid to upper 60s will be the rule. So again, should be a beautiful day for any outdoor plans. And there'll probably be a spot or two even making it to 70 tomorrow afternoon. Looking outside this evening, though, we've got clear skies right now. Great view here on the Wade's RV Weather Camera Network. Temperature wise, again, right now we're still at 63, but we'll cool things down as we head through the remainder of the evening. And we did make it up into the upper 60s this afternoon for that high. And again, clear skies right now. You can see a few high level clouds out here to our west and to our north and west. Nothing that's producing any precipitation, however. And we'll keep it mostly clear tonight. Now, high pressures out here to our east. We started noticing that southerly flow coming back today. We'll have a much steadier south to southeast breeze tomorrow. There will be a chance for a few showers and storms even up into parts of Kansas tomorrow afternoon, but we'll stay dry here eastern Oklahoma and southeastern portions of Kansas. But as more moisture continues to increase out of the south as this front gets a little bit closer, we'll likely cloud things up as we go into Sunday. So mostly cloudy skies with a slight chance of a shower by Sunday afternoon, but by Sunday evening and Sunday night as this front gets a little bit closer, those rain chances are likely going to go up. So I'll leave just a slight chance in there for your afternoon plans on Sunday, but then we'll bump up that chance as we go into Sunday evening and into Sunday night. So again, an isolated shower possible during the daytime hours on Sunday, but notice how much more widespread it gets by Sunday night. And even as we head into Monday, scattered to widespread storms will be likely, but they will move out as we go into the afternoon and evening as the front continues to move on through and into next week, not looking as chilly as what we were thinking yesterday. So I have bumped up our temperatures here at the end of next week. So we'll have that first front come in on Monday with a decent opportunity for showers and storms. I think our severe threat here locally looks fairly low, but you get down into the Red River Valley, down into parts of Texas, there probably will be some severe weather with this system. And then still looking good on Tuesday, a little cooler behind that next front middle of next week. But again, Bumped up the temperatures from the chill that we had in there last night's forecast, and we'll get you into next weekend coming up at around 6 o'clock.